okay welcome once again to today's scenario uh, if you have not subscribed to this channel please like this video share it subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification button so that when next we post a video like this you will get notified all right today as we know that we are in the season of the valentine you know like sharing gifts with your loved and then appreciating their love all right uh before, today we will be sharing what do i need to know before i say will you marry me as a guy as a man you are proposing to you are intending to propose to a lady a christian lady or to your spouse and you want to propose or you want to you are in a relationship and you want to intend to like propose to a lady what do you need to know before saying will you marry me to a lady thank you sir i want to hear from you sir all right we thank god for the season of love uh of course the season has been bastardized by so many but that does also remove the fact that it's still the season of love and uh, we need to talk about the issues of love in a time like this <clears throat> i used to tell singles about to marry that uh, after god has spoken yes god has spoken god does not still remove your brain so there is a place of god says and there is a place of can we go together there are two things god must speak yes god must be the one leading yes god must convince you must be convinced this and that now the other question now is can we go together because the bible also said can two work together except they agree so looking at the aspect of as god spoken is something that we we'll talk about some other time but because we're in the season of love i want to give a general perspective of what and what and what do I need to know before I ask a lady that uh, will you marry me? Now, for a man, what are the things that you need to know before you approach a lady? Even after you have been sure of prayer and other things, the first thing is one. Is this someone I can love irrespective of? And I mean that word with all sense of responsibility. Can I love this person irrespective of? That is, even if she eventually have an accident tomorrow and one leg is broken, she is amputated, uh, the face is mad, or whatever, whatever, can I still love this lady? Can I still love this woman? If after everything that looks accessible or that looks attractive, I no longer there. That irrespective, that is, remove every factors. You see, if you are in love and you love somebody because of a particular reason, Ah, ah, one day, one day, that reason will no longer be there. So, you as a guy, you must ask yourself, even when there is no more any reason to love, can I still love this person? If you find it in your heart that even without a reason, you can still love, that's one thing that you must look for in a lady before you say, Will you marry me? That's number one. Number two, is this lady mature? You see, maturity is so important when it comes to the lady you want to marry. Why? Because uh, an average woman brain is like baby's brain they think like a baby that's why sometimes a, a lady can just burst into cry and begin a, on small small issues so you need someone that is mature you have to look and observe is this person matured such that if there are issues of life and of course there will be issues there will be challenges can this person handle it maturely even before you propose and say will you marry me please you must sort these things out is this person mature enough? That's the number two important thing. Number three is, is this person a person of understanding? Does she show understanding in issues? Can she understand certain things? There's a place of maturity, yes. Some people may be mature, but they don't have understanding. Any small thing, they, they begin to react. When there is no money, even though they know that there is no money, they begin to show certain reactions. But can she show understanding in certain issues for your weaknesses and your strengths, for when things are good and when things are not? Is she an understanding person? If she's an understanding person, then you can say, will you marry me? And lastly, is she a good manager? And when I mean good manager, I mean, I meant it with all sense of responsibility. Is she a good manager? Some many of the ladies out there, they won't help you to manage your resources. They will help you to squander it. So can she manage talking? Can she help you to plan your life? Can she help you to manage things together and make things work? That is probably 31 woman. She's a good manager. 
she can effectively use one naira plus two naira and make it to become four naira to become ten and twenty naira and manage resources well such that in the absence of enough resources and even when there are enough resources she will still be able to help you build your life until your life take proper shape not the one that is always unnecessarily flamboyant unnecessarily demanding unless i want to buy things and uh, he's always asking you for the most expensive one ah you better think twice before you react will you marry me so you need these things love irrespective of is she mature you know does she have understanding and is she a good manager if you can find this apart from the father god has spoken and you can still find all of this then you can say will you marry me she will be a good wife